Good morning, everybody. I hope that you're having a wonderful day. I am enjoying the solitude and quiet and silence that today brings. And in sitting in my gratitude for the day, I was remembering this wonderful oil that I love to use, Litsia, and went to it. And because also it's one of the products of the, the month this month, you can actually get it um, for free this month if you are a member with doTERRA and you do a loyalty order. And it is the oil of gratitude. And I have this wonderful, um, somebody gifted me this beautiful book on the emotions of the essential oils. So this is another resource that I am using. And so I'm going to start with one of the quotes that's read in here. And it says, give yourself permission to see and feel the extraordinary events in your own life. In embodying them, you will also find your perspective about life and in it, and its meaning will change, resulting in growth and expansion. And that's a quote from Susan Barbara Apollon, and it is for the Litsia essential oil. And as we know, as you may or may not know, Litsia has some amazing physical properties because of the content of geraniol, Nerol and limonene. So with those, we understand with those properties that it brings some good detoxifying properties. It brings some really nice refreshing and uplifting properties um, that we absolutely love and it can be used for lots of different things. Previously, um, physically anyway, I like to use it to support um, my allergy responses and just to kind of sometimes for cleaning or um, to put on topically for different reasons and in today in in what's been going on for me emotionally over the last little while i have found myself reaching for this oil to put in my diffuser blends i will also um Take, put a drop and put it over my heart area as well as my solar plexus and um, I just love using that for that. So I want to go through some of the emotional um, properties that when we breathe in that aromatherapy how it can help support our brain in different ways and uplifting and relaxing right but also how it can help open us up in the world and so it's very sweet revitalizing oil and so it's it's really brings out that happiness. So I'm gonna to read to you a little bit what this book says um, here about Litsia because it's just such a beautiful way to describe it. And in bringing in that gratitude of the day um, with, for everything that we have, for where we are heading, all of that, the cleansing properties of Litsia um, combined with its abilities to elevate our spirit is helpful when we're feeling stressed, anxious, or nervous. So it's a really beautiful choice when we're overthinking things, when whether it's an upcoming event that's coming or feeling fear um, for ourselves or for anything else, we can bring this oil to help increase our self-assurance and to support us in these situations bringing um, helping us feel more capable and confident and so it can help dissolve that darkness that we're feeling that is the energy that brings in the fear and the stress right so that we can help move that clear that detox that out of our fields and in, out of our lives so and if you want to choose to um, enjoy this a little bit deeper you can actually use it to help you go through those different layers of healing and expansion and really bring in a strong sense of mindfulness to your projects, to your day, to your, um, to your life. So Litsy is perfect for the person that feels their emotions and environment deeply because it refreshes the spirit and reminds you not to take life too seriously and your worthiness of all the love of all the love and joy that is around you all right so when we're dwelling in the self-pity and we're feeling very disconnected or lonely misunderstood this is a great essential oil to use um, also if you're feeling in that I can't or you're feeling I'm stuck 
um, whether it be in life or whether it be with a certain project that you're working on. So Litzia will clear those limiting attitudes, allowing you to see through that darkness and that victim mentality and move you through into a state of more positive conviction and empowerment. So it can help you really embrace in the adventures and in the joy of life and the radiance um, kind of like the sound of your children laughing when they're having fun and it's there's no better sound it brings that sense into your life when you're when you um, are using this oil as well the oil of gratitude um, so it will really encourage you to celebrate life celebrate all that you have that you got up this morning that you accomplished whatever it is that you wanted to do or just be in the moment and enjoy and listen so a little reflection that you can do for yourself is really, you know, so here's some questions that it asks us here in this book. And this is something that I'm really enjoying working through myself as I learn more about the depths of the emotions that I can use these oils for. And are all of our plants, our garden plants and, and um, trees and everything. So how often do you get caught up in the dark moods? burdened with worry and a negative outlook on a given situation. So we can ponder on that, think about that, you can journal on it. Does your mind jump onto old thought patterns that bring in overwhelming surges of fear, panic, or emotional destruction? Are you overly serious taking the injustices and wrongdoings of the world and those around you personally? Right? Things happen around us all the time, but is it truly personal? And so um, we can use that. Do your problems and challenges distract you from enjoying and embracing life? Do you tend to see more darkness in your life than beauty, joy, and wonderment? Do you need regular doses of external motivation or inspiration to pursue your dreams? Have you got a daily gratitude practice? And if you do, could it use a little more inspiration, intention behind it? So as we move that, the um, arrow the aromatic um, properties, the emotional properties that Litzia will help us, um, especially over the heart chakra. So we, our, our heart energy point is gonna be great. It's gonna help actually balance a little bit of that masculine energy that that is um, that we carry. And it is very uplifting. So it's gonna help elevate the abundance, the celebration, the cleansing, confidence, determination, inspiration, and joy. And if you're looking for something to blend it with, um, I'm really loving the black spruce actually right now, but it blends really well with all kinds of different oils. You can put it with some cedar wood. If you're wanting to bring in that gratitude for community, the cinnamon, if you want to spice things up a little more, other citrus oils are also really nice. Frankincense, cypress, um, sandalwood, all kinds of wonderful oils like that. So you can think about energetic pairing of the oils if there's something that you're wanting to bring. So like cedar wood is the oil of community and you're wanting gratitude for community, you can pair them up like that. But if you're really wanting to maybe um, see more of the joy of life and you can pair it with another citrus oil as well. Bring in the abundance into your life, gratitude for the abundance of all that surrounds you. You could put the litzia with the wild orange. Um, maybe add in some other spices or um, trees in there as well. So I hope this is helpful. I'm really loving uh, working through this and today I am grateful for my day of silence, uh, at least a few hours of it, right? And um, just being with myself, I took today off. This is the only work thing that I'm gonna be doing and it's work, but it's also just sharing my reflections on uh, some of the practices that I do. So I hope this is helpful to you. I'd love to hear how you're using Litzia or how you like to pronounce it even. Um, Litzi, Litzia, and any of uh, how you like to diffuse it or use it in your life. If you have any fun recipes, um, I'd love to hear them too. So have a wonderful day.